her third married, her third married ended a few days ago. Every evil plans programmed to destroy your happiness. In the name of Jesus Christ, I scatter that plan. My people, spiritual controls the physical. Believe it. He said, Mommy, I am tired. My third marriage ended five days ago. I am in pain. Before I tell you what happened, you have to be careful even while you are still not married. I want to quickly give you some more advice before I bring up what happened. It is not every single mother you see out there that wish to be a single mother. Some of the things that happen in their life are not a physical battle. Spiritual controls the physical. Don't laugh at anybody if you don't know what really happened that ended their relationship. God bless you. Her first husband paid her bride price. After one child, he ended the marriage for nothing. The family of the lady returned the bride price. And she left that house. I will not bring out more details because of some privacy issues. Okay, but there is something you need to know. So after two years, during these two years, she said suitors everywhere. She know they lack suitors, like people wants to get married to her. Are you getting it? Spiritual controls the physical. The second husband came. She accepted and another bride price was paid. After one issue again, if you hear me saying spiritual controls the physical, believe it. If you don't believe it's your own. After one child again, the marriage ended for nothing. Like nothing. I wish you, 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 you can hear her explaining how she tried her best to put this man for head for anything not to happen again. But that's not where the issue lies. Yes, it is not a physical one. After the uh, second, the second, after the, the second marriage, after the first child again, the marriage ended. The bread price was returned again. The third one came. After three years. And she was like, I do not want them to pay bread price anymore because I don't know. Maybe after giving birth to one or two child, I will, they will come and pay my bread price. Because maybe it is because she was like, maybe it is because of the bread price. That is where the fight is coming from. The third one did not pay bread price. They were together. And after one child, everything left again. The man said, go, I do not want marriage. I will end it there. What is your own message from me on this issue? As I said, I don't want to go further on her issues. The teaching is, when first thing happened to you, learn to pay attention. This is a thing like, you know you try your best. You sh we are supposed to know when something is physical or a spiritual one. First thing happened to you, you have to make sure you calm down. Be sensitive enough to know the right fight to fight. Don't be in a hurry to move. Second one happened. You were supposed to know that this is not a fight that you can fight for yourself. There is something that you need to separate yourself from. Someone might be in this very position right now, like this same issue right now. See, don't be in a hurry to jump into a relationship anymore. You might not succeed in the other one. What has been programmed, what the enemy programmed, need to be deprogrammed so that you will be able to move on i will pray for you again in the name of jesus every evil plant programmed to destroy your sources your efforts and your happiness in the name of jesus i deprogram that useless program learn to be sensitive and learn to know when it is prayer needed or character needed a good character needed you cannot push a good character in a place where
prayer is needed, it will not work. Because there is a difference between physical and the spiritual. Are you getting it? For this video not to be too long, please make sure you always go to God in prayers. When something is happening to you, repeatedly, it happened before, it happened again, and it happened again. What you need is God, the one that can break any yoke. There is a yoke that needs to be broken. It is not what you can do on your own. Yes, so there is a power that is fighting you. And no power is greater than the power of God. That is the reason why you have to push prayer. Bring it to God. The one.